What's up guys? We got an interesting food review. You already see it in the uh, you already see it in the title. And this is I mean what it says. This is the Pizza Hut grilled cheese stuffed crust pizza. As you see right there. Uh let you know, let's kind of give it a you know, smelling it now it smells really good. Actually, the pizza looks pretty good. Good. Uh, smelling it when I, when the chick gave it to me, I was like, "Wow, oh, man, I really don't want to eat this." <laughs> but that's what this channel's for. Uh, grilled cheese stuffed crust pizza. Uh, the toppings I have on there is just pepperoni. I didn't feel like paying for extra because I didn't know if I would like this pizza. But the whole point of it is the stuff. Uh, the stuff part of it is supposed to be grilled. Uh, well, it's supposed to be. You know, it's supposed to be a grilled cheese. So if we can actually survey one of them, okay. I'd tell you right now, if I would have pulled my grilled cheese apart, it would have, like, some cheese would have came with it. But anyways, <clears throat> trying to give a good look at it. it. It's really, like, a golden crust to it. And one thing I do like, you know, you ever have, like, grilled cheese, like, bleeding out the side of it? Like, it, it kind of, like, burns it at the bottom? Well, that's what that looks like right there. And that, actually, that's one thing I like about it. Smelling it, there's no, like, I smell the cheese, it might be like cheddar, not too sure what type of cheese it is, but let's give it a try. So the whole point of this is to try out <coughs> the, the grilled cheese part to it. So we'll take a bite of the crust and see how that comes out. So let's, there's the crust and... That's not bad. You know, now that I think about it, <clears throat> the regular stuffed crust is just like mozzarella cheese. Like, I mean, all this is just a different colored cheese inside of it. But that actually wasn't that bad. Um, I guess it did kind of taste like a grilled cheese. I mean, I can see that it might have some type of crumbs on here. I guess kind of give that bread breadish taste to it. Let's try, let's taste. Let's take another bite. That isn't so bad as I thought it would be. Well, that, I mean, that's just the damn crust, but. Now, the next bite we're going to take is this is a part of the pizza and the crust also. So, this one's going to be kind of uh, tricky. So, let's see. How the fuck am I going to do this? Okay, here we go. Let's try it. Now, because this is the part. This is what makes the pizza. Like, if you eat the pizza, then you eat the crust. Like, you know, does it still taste good? So let's see. I saw I got some crust right here. I got some pizza. It doesn't taste bad, but it tastes weird though. So let me see. I mean, it's interesting. I mean, you know what? This could have went totally different than I thought it would have been, but I'm pretty impressed with this. Okay, <clears throat> now. That, uh, so let, let's, let's kind of get into the review part of that. <coughs> um, so the question is, do you see yourself buying it? You know, if there's a game day or whatever, and you know, I'm going to just tell you, I would probably come out better just buying the stuffed crust, um, just the regular stuffed crust, you know? This is not bad. I mean, if you're if you're by yourself, like you got a movie night, like I got a movie about to go on, have some pizza with it, then yeah, I, I wouldn't mind ordering this. I wouldn't mind ordering this again. This was pretty good, especially if you don't need, like, if you want to eat grilled cheese and pizza together. Like hell, you can cut off all the edges and just have grilled cheese one day, and then have the uh, pizza edges the next. But what I'm curious is how this is gonna taste when it gets cold and you have to heat the pizza up. I've never had the heat of a grilled cheese before, so I'm that's where I'm kind of like, you know, iffy about it. And Pizza Hut already has my uh, disgust when it comes to their pizza because I've been kind of sick of it lately. Uh, we're going to get into my food rating scale. So the things I do give it points on is for not only, like, because we had the garlic knot. I had the garlic knot pizza, which you can see uh I'll post down in the description where you will see be able to see that. And I told them, you just come out better just making garlic knots. So one thing about this pizza, pizza just make grilled cheese crust. Like, or mozzarella sticks grilled cheese white. 
I think that would be super fucking weird, but it'd be dope. Uh, definitely have some mozzarella to go with it. Why wasn't no mozzarella a part of this? I have no idea. Didn't feel like ordering any. So you know what? We're gonna. You know what? I. You know I'm pretty impressed with this because I thought this was gonna go pretty bad. I'm gonna give this a four. So that's the end all be all. This is a pizza, I, like I said, I could see myself ordering again. I, I wasn't disgusted by it. It tasted good. The only problem is, uh, is if I have to heat it up, how will it taste? And I can only imagine the cheese is going to be gooing out of it. Um, but yeah, it's an end-all be-all. It, it deserves a four. Uh, it's really good. It's very. I would recommend it to anybody. Uh, now, would you eat it? That's the question. Um, but yeah, it, it changes, you know, it... It does something different. It, basically, I mean, all it's doing is just adding a different cheese, but it's also adding like the the impression of a grilled cheese on a pizza. And it tasted good when I ate some of the pepperoni with it, kind of give it that flavor. Now I wish I ordered bacon on it because grilled cheese and bacon goes together really good. So I think if you order this, order a bacon pe bacon grilled cheese pizza. I think that would be the perfect combination. Because bacon goes with, I mean, who doesn't add bacon in their grilled cheese? Anyways, Pizza Hut's grilled cheese stuffed crust pizza, it's a four. It's the end all be all. It, deser it, it deserves it. I mean, it, it changes the formula of something that's been like hella badass since they originally came out with stuffed crust pizza. It doesn't do that bullshit like the garlic knots did. It's just like, it's whatever it's it deserves its own thing it's basically just a different cheese inside of it but it goes good with it with the the you know the bakedness the butter that they put on top of the crust whatever anyways it's a four it is what it is pizza hut good job on this one hey give me a bacon one. uh anyways guys comment like subscribe to make sure you happy these days this has been my food review let me know how it is peace out guys have a good one